And the Kano State Governor, Alhaji Abba Kabir Yusuf, has ordered the immediate arrest of the deposed Emir of Kano, Aminu Ado Bayeru, accusing him of creating tension within the state. This directive comes just two days after Bayeru was deposed by the governor. According to the spokesperson for the governor, the former emir was allegedly smuggled into Kano City last night in an attempt to reclaim the palace forcefully. The statement emphasized the government's commitment to maintaining peace and order, highlighting that any actions undermining this stability would be met with strict measures. Meanwhile, the deputy governor insists due process was followed and that the government believes some higher power is backing the deposed emir. The constitution is very, very clear about that. Nobody has any jurisdiction on this apart from these two tiers of government and these three um, areas, the state assembly, the governor and the local government. So nobody has any right to interfere or enforce or force anybody on Kano people. The Office of National Security Advisor has been using the security personnel. We understand that early this morning, they have charted a plight or two for the former Emir of Kano, Aminu, Bayero. They brought him back. He's currently at the airport, waiting to be taken to a destination. But our information is telling us they wanted to bring him back to this house, this Colonel Emma's palace. As you must have seen, we are here, all of us, the members of the State House of Assembly. His Excellency, the Executive Governor of Kano State, has been personally here for the last four hours or so. We brought the Emir here to come and assume duty and continue his normal uh, administration of the Emirate uh, Council.